Welcome to Ucanic. In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform battery programming or registration on Volvos. So Volvo started requiring um, battery programming on some of the newer models. Uh, so what that actually does is when you uh, once you put the new battery in place, you need to go in and tell the computer in the car that this is a new battery because what happens to the, the car monitors the battery and if it's an older battery, the charging patterns of that battery are different. It will require more uh, current to be sent to an older battery to charge it uh, and so on and you know the way that it operates when it's the engine is running is slightly different so in order to do that you install the new battery and then you use a scanner like the Ucanic full system scanner you go to maintenance function from the home screen and then you select BRT on the left here you select Volvo down here and then you can select manual selection you can do smart pin I'll show you the long route. 2016 and up. This is 2020. Uh, this is North America. And you can see a lot of the models. S60 from 2011 and up. Uh, you can see S80 from some 2007s and up. And you know, all these different models that require it. Anyway, uh, let's go to XC90 and 2020. That's the all-wheel drive. And then you can check the state of health on the battery. But what we're interested in, we're setting the information to zero on power supply when replacing battery. And that's the one that uh, you were interested in, especially when you reset. Follow these instructions there, turn on the ignition. Uh, press OK here, press start. It says the vehicle must be in usage mode. Let's go over this because I did miss one step. First, you're gonna turn the start button. Don't start the engine. Do not press the brake pedal. Press and hold this and hold it for five seconds. What you'll see is all the lights come on, but the engine will not start. So that's what, where you wanna be. Otherwise, you're gonna get the error that I got earlier. You get reset, press okay. Press okay again, press start. Give it a minute and routine completed. So make sure you do not miss that step of turning on the ignition without starting the car. Press and hold this for five seconds. And that's what I was missing there. Um, so that's all. Thank you for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.